We're headed to John Wayne Airport to pick up one of the most important people in my life, my dad. It's gonna be my dad, here we go. <laughs> what is Corsa mode? Corsa mode is race mode. The shifting is so Yikes. Wow, it is, it wow. pulls. Well, it's been a long seven months, but I'm excited to announce that the Lamborghini Liberty Walk Limited Edition Aventador Roadster is finally done. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. This car has just completely exceeded my expectations. This is way better than I ever could have imagined. I'm trying to fake my way through this right now because a month ago my dad had a heart attack and it led to a stroke. And he was put in the hospital. And, and, and thankfully, I was able to fly home to see him. And I spent the best two days I've ever had with my dad. Two nights ago, we... Two, Two nights ago, we finished the car at 10 p.m. Two and a half hours later, my dad, he had another heart attack. He died. And I just, I just miss him so much. And this is the first video. This is the first video I've ever filmed. But he's not gonna be watching. <laughs> I know I shouldn't be filming a video right now, but for one reason or another, I feel like because we finished the car and he died a couple hours later, this car is like in remembrance of him. And just want to honor him some way and I don't know how. And the two days I spent with him in the hospital, he was so excited about the project and he loved the color and he couldn't wait to see the end product and he's never going to see it, but... As a follower of Jesus, I know that I know that he's in heaven. And that I I hope he looks down. I hope he's looking down and he's proud of me. I don't know if I'm ever even gonna post this, but I just I just love my dad so much and I'm so grateful. He was 67 years old and he died fast and without much pain and I'm so grateful for the time that I had with him because I know there's so many people out there who who lose their father or their mother or a close loved one so much sooner than I did and I had I had 32 years with him but I just wish I had one more day the car is done I'm so thrilled with how the car turned out like it just completely exceeded my expectations and it's so crazy because I was so excited and now the car feels so meaningless but at the same time it has so much meaning it's the Rosa Cantus, the one of one <laughs> with the Liberty Walk wide body kit. It has the white Vossen wheels that look so good. It just looks so, so good. And my homie Dave, my homie Dave fought cancer. He beat cancer. And this is the first Lamborghini he's ever, ever painted. And fittingly, it was finished in pink. And Dave is such a hero. And I'm, I'm so glad that he was able to paint this car. And he did such an amazing job. And just the back end of this car is so crazy. How you can see the tires and the massive carbon diffuser and this overly ridiculous wing. And the vanity plate I'm going to change to to Dad's Lambo. It's just... I'm sorry, guys. I just... I don't know what to do. I, I just, I love my dad so much and I just wish he was here. I know this is the worst reveal video I've ever filmed and I'm sorry, I know I sound pathetic crying. I just love my dad so much and I feel so fortunate because he was such a good dad. He was so supportive of me for so long. I still remember lowest moment in my life 
I was living at home and uh, this was right after I had lived in my car and I moved back in with my parents and I got this job as a night auditor and I was working the graveyard shift 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. and I had no friends and I was just miserable I was down and out and I remember this one one day at Sabelli's this pizza place and I was so rude to my parents at this time in my life because I was so unhappy and I was so just mad at society because for whatever reason everything hadn't been just handed to me and I just remember my dad was there and he told me something it wasn't anything profound he just told me that he believed in me and that he knew that my time was coming and that life is hard but for every for every down there's an up and that he knew, he knew, and he was so confident, he was so loving, he knew that my time was coming. And it was within a month, I met Nick, I filmed a viral video at the Sun Valley event, and, and the rest is history, and he just had such confidence in me, and he loved convertibles, he loved roadsters, and I just wish he was here for 20 minutes, and we could take the top off the car and just go drive up the canyon and listen to the V12. It's never gonna happen. I just wish that it could. My dad was never like the coolest dad. He was never the hip dad. He wore the $9 shorts. <laughs> he wore the, whole, the shirts with holes in them. He didn't care about that stuff. But he never missed. He never missed any baseball games I ever played in. He went to every single cross country meet and he was always there. He never lied. I can never remember one single time when my dad lied. I just, I just want to be like my dad. So I just, like, he didn't care about stuff like this. Like he didn't care about material possessions. And they're so pointless. Like I just encourage you guys. Like if, if you're fortunate enough to still have your parents alive, or or somebody very close to you that that is equivalent to like a parent, spend time with them because life is short and. I just, I flew home and I, I spent two days with him. And I rushed back here to continue building this car. And I just wish I would have spent a couple more days with him. I'm so sorry this video is all over the place. I just wanted to share the car with you because I'm so proud of it. And I'm headed home to spend time with my family and I don't really know when I'm gonna be back. And I don't want to leave you guys waiting because I'm just, I'm so excited and I hope some of you guys were excited about it too. And I just wish, one more time, just one time, my dad did ride in this car. Before we started the Liberty Walk Wide Body, he did ride with us, ride in the car with me one time, and he loved the roof off so much because you can hear the V12 so good, and he loved that experience so much. And I, I wish we could go on one more ride. I know this isn't a very good video, and I probably shouldn't even be filming this at all, but I guess this is my best way for closure because YouTube's like my medium of how I express myself. I, tr I tried so hard to film a video this morning and I tried to fake it and I, I just couldn't do it. I just, I just want to honor my dad. This is the only way I know how to do it and I know my dad is in heaven and I just can't wait to see him someday up there and I want to tell my mom that I love her. She's so much stronger than me and she's, she's such an amazing woman and my dad was so lucky to be able to find her and, and she was so lucky to be able to find my dad and I don't know how I'm so fortunate, how I'm so blessed. I had this whole plan for the car of how I wanted to reveal it. We were gonna show the build from start to finish and so I've edited a bunch of that. I'm gonna play that in the meantime. Um, I just, I can't thank you guys enough for everything. You guys mean everything to me and my last request is just call your mom or your dad or our loved one today. And just tell them you love them. Just, just do that for me. I'm very anxious to see you guys' comments. This is a cold straw on a stock exhaust on the new supercar. It's a very distinct note. I'm sure you guys are going to recognize it. That's right, boys!
today's video. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to vlog box number one for my Liberty Walk wide body kit has finally arrived and it would appear that it had quite the arduous journey, you might say. Tokyo is a long ways from Salt Lake City, but uh, it says handle with care. It appears that there was a lot of care handling this package. I'm pretty sure everything will be okay, I hope. Um, I hope. What? Look at that carbon fiber. Now step one is obviously safety. No matter how many times I jump start this event door. There we go! <laughs> I had no idea what I was doing, and I took my time. You guys are patient. It turned out so good. <laughs> 